You're watching WMAR 2 News. Hi, I'm Ashley James. The first of three presidential debates is tonight in Cleveland. President Trump and Joe Biden on the same stage for the very first time. Because of the coronavirus, there will be no handshakes, also no opening statements. The debate is scheduled for 90 minutes, six 15-minute segments on different topics. No commercials. The first question will go to President Trump. Joe Biden has taken time off the campaign trail recently. Staffers say he's been getting ready for the debate. President Trump, though, says he doesn't have time for that. I'm running a country. I'm, I don't, you know, I don't have the luxury. He's going to want to make it personal. He's going to want to get in the mosh pit. I'm going to talk about why I want to be president of the United States. Right now, Biden has a lead in national polls over the president. Tonight's debate starts at 9 o'clock in Cleveland. You can watch it right here on WMAR2, and you can be sure that one of the topics will be the coronavirus because it's still out there. And with flu season coming up, we want to make sure that you have all of your questions answered. So tomorrow is a day of answers on WMAR2 News. We're going to have interviews all day long, starting with Good Morning Maryland. We sat down with an expert on controlling infectious diseases from GBMC about just how important it is to get the flu vaccine this year. Then at 1030 and at 3 in the afternoon, head to the WMAR 2 News Facebook page for Facebook Live discussions about the flu. The day of answers continues on WMAR 2 News at 5, 6 and 7. Again, tomorrow is our day of answers on the flu on air and online. WMAR 2 News and at WMAR 2 News.com. Now from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Happy Tuesday, everyone. On this Tuesday, we are tracking unsettled conditions. As we go into the afternoon, we do have those showers and thunderstorms that will rumble through. We're also tracking above average temperatures for today and the high humidity for today. And then we have a nice weekend cool down that's on the way. But in terms of the muggy meter, it's up today, then back down as we work our way in through tomorrow and beyond. So that's definitely some good news if you're not a fan of the high humidity. The future cast picking up on some scattered showers moving in here, I'd say between lunchtime and two o'clock, but then the bulk of the action, the thunderstorm action will be in here as we head towards about four o'clock, six o'clock this evening. High temperatures today coming in right around 76 degrees, so we will be slightly above average and mid 60s by the weekend. Ashley. All right, Lynette, thank you. Stay with us online at WMAR2news.com for updates and for news and weather while you're on the go. Download the WMAR2 News app in the App Store. You can watch live radar and get breaking news sent straight to your phone. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Ashley James. This WMAR2 News update is sponsored by Jones Junction.